Thank you very much. We're here today to defend free speech from one of the gravest dangers it has faced in American history, frankly. And you know what's going on as well as anybody. It's not good. A small handful of powerful social media monopolies controls a vast portion of all public and private communications in the United States. And we know what they are. We don't have to name them. Uh, we're going to give you a complete uh, listing. We're going to give you a uh, signed copy of what I'm going to be signing in a couple of minutes, and you'll see exactly what we're doing. Uh, they've had unchecked power to censor, restrict, edit, shape, hide, alter virtually any form of communication between private citizens or large public audiences. There's no precedent in American history for so small a number of corporations to control so large a sphere of human interaction. Therefore, today I'm signing an executive order to protect and uphold the free speech and rights of the American people. Currently, social media giants like Twitter receive an unprecedented liability shield based on the theory that they're a neutral platform, which they are not, not an editor with a viewpoint. My executive order calls for new regulations under Section 230 of the Communications Decency Act to make it that social media companies that engage in censoring or any political conduct will not be able to keep their liability shield. That's a big deal. They have a shield. They can do what they want. They have a shield. They're not going to have that shield. My executive order further instructs the Federal Trade Commission, FTC, to prohibit social media companies from engaging in any deceptive acts or practices affecting commerce. This authority resides in Section 5 of the Federal Trade Commission Act.